Hi guys, I have for us the 302 UBH Outback Ultralight. So these are a lot lighter in weight compared to your regular Outbacks, um, but they still have a lot of features to offer. And I think this one has a pretty unique floor plan. This camper actually comes in weighing a little bit over 6,900 pounds. So it's still on the lighter range. A lot of vehicles are still able to tow this. I'm gonna point out some features on the outside first. So you have your power tongue jack at the front. All you have to do is just press a button and it does the work for you. So it's very user friendly. And it even has a utility light. So if you happen to get to the campground while it's still dark outside, you can still be able to see it and you know use it. Just behind it is two propane tanks under this plastic casing. And then of course you do have your fiberglass front cap with really cool accent lights. And this does have the industry's best three-year limited structural warranty. Coming to our camping side, right next to that is your pass-through storage. Great spot to put any extra camping gear that you want to bring that you might not have room for um, inside the actual coach. This does have a front and rear electric stabilizer jacks. Plus, you have this huge power awning, which is great for relaxing, especially by your campfire. You can stay nice and cool and shaded, um, or if it happens to be a really hot day. Plus, they do have a little bit of accent lights, which look awesome. Outside shower, you can kind of rinse off whatever, use it for whatever. And then at your entrance are the LCI solid steps. So these will fold into your camper nicely, very sturdy. Even those pets to get in and out of the camper, um, they love them so much. Plus you have this stability helper handle and you have the friction hinge door. So you don't have to worry about this slamming into the camper if it happens to be pretty windy. Moving along, you also have your satellite and cable hookup for your key TV out here as well as a 110 outlet. So if you happen to want to get a TV out here, you can do that, prop it up on a table. And then you have an outside kitchen on this camper. So a lot of people love this. You can set juice boxes in there, adult beverages, um, and especially if your kids are running around getting dirty, you don't have to worry about them tracking mud and stuff inside your camper. They can just come and get something to drink out here. So you have all of this countertop space for food prep, but just underneath, if I'm able to do it with one hand, you have a couple burners. And then of course you have a mini fridge too, and some additional storage for utensils and things like that. You also have outside speakers that are Bluetooth capable. And then all the way at the rear, you do have a ladder, which means you have a fully walkable roof to keep up on the maintenance with your camper. And then I went ahead and opened this, but this is just some additional storage. You can fit really, really tall items in here. Plus you also have a light, so kind of use it for whatever that you want. So now let's take a look at the inside. We're gonna start at the very front so I can save the best for last. And the front happens to be the master bedroom. So you got your queen size bed, really long end tables on both sides. The one on the left is slightly longer than the end table on the right, but the one on the right actually has a hamper that goes out into your laundry chute so if you happen to accumulate a lot of dirty clothes while you're on vacation you can just throw them in there and not really have to think about all the clutter and stuff there is outlets on both sides but the one on the right has a usb port both can charge electronics or if you have a sleep bat machine and then above each nightstand you also have a closet locker with a built-in clothes rack two additional cabinets um, that connects in between, plus this shelf back here for some decorations. And each side has its own light. You are also prepped for a second AC here in the bedroom to stay nice and cool. And you even have your own access door into the bathroom so you don't have to tread into the hallway and the kitchen area, wake up any of your guests. You can just access the bathroom right here if you need to go. Underneath the bed, you also have storage but what's really unique about this that all Outbacks do, there is a built-in kennel, which is amazing. So this is a very pet-friendly camper. And I want to mention there is absolutely zero carpet besides what's lined up just right there on your nightstand. There is zero carpet, which makes for easy cleanup, especially with that pet hair. 
And then if you can see right next to your um, bedroom, or not bedroom, bathroom entrance, you can hang up an LCD mounting bracket. Of course, you have all of your TV hookups and stuff right there. Get yourself a TV in here. And then coming out, I love the angled um, bathroom door. It's just something different with the floor plan. You have your porcelain foot flush toilet to the left. And then straight across is your nice rounded out shower with the gorgeous matte black faucet and shower head, which I love. And of course, you have the skylight up there. And then you got your sink, same matching faucet, outlet if you need it, storage below, as well as above in the medicine cabinet. And then coming out into our kitchen and living room space. Right next to our bathroom door is your entertainment center. Big electric fireplace, and this will actually take the chill out of the air. If it happens to be a chilly morning or a chilly evening, or you can just turn it on and have the really pretty lights going. And then just above is your Jensen um, system to be able to access your outside speakers as well as your inside speakers. And then your swivel TV. Even more storage up above. And then kind of wrapping along right next to your entrance is just kind of like hallway storage. You can put some coats or sweatshirts in there. Maybe some dog leashes, shoes, things like that. And you also have a couple hangers for your keys. And then for a perfect view right next to your TV is your theater recliner seats, built-in cup holders with remote control storage or snack storage. And like I said, there is zero carpet in this camper. And as you can see on the slide out, um, it is the same flooring that is on the main portion of the camper. Right next to that is your booth dinette. So this will fold down into a sleeping space um, for any extra guests, maybe one to two kids depending on size, but definitely three people can sleep in here so far. I'm gonna save the best for last, but definitely three people, one in there and two in your bedroom. Very plush material and the nice thing about um, this table is that you don't have a leg right in the middle so people who are tall and have longer legs don't have to worry about kicking the middle part of the table. The price also comes out to be $35,995 for everything and I want to mention before I forget this is a Four Seasons camper. And now into our kitchen area you have your refrigerator really good size too. Three burner top stove with a glass range cover. So when you are ready to use your stove top, you just fold the glass up like so. And then it doubles as a backsplash so grease and stuff doesn't splash all over your blinds and your pretty walls. And then there's your oven. Then you have your vent fan and extra light for your range. Microwave is just above there. And it even comes with a built-in wine rack, which is awesome. At kind of an angle is some additional cabinets and it goes back really far too. Down below is the same matching black matte, black matte faucet. Um, you have your spray nozzle, open mount, stainless steel sink with a roll up cover. You can also place this down when you're wanting to have space for food prep and just be able to make your food and just place things on top of this too. Even more storage down below. And then just some extra countertop space right here and just this itty bitty cabinet. And then last but not least, behind this gorgeous barn style sliding door that is magnetic, it has a magnetic strip. You have this really awesome bunk house for your kiddos. So you have three sets of bunks and storage that connects all down below too. So they have plenty of room for all of their toys and their clothes and things like that. Um, nice little spot down here. There is plugs on each bunk too, so they can plug their electronics. Windows are everywhere on each bunk as well. And then just behind me is a spot for a key TV in here, so you can have another TV placed in here. Kind of have the door closed so the kiddos can be nice and loud, put a kid's movie on. The weight range, if I can find it, is 300 pounds, so even if you have teenagers or full-size adults sleeping in here, your friends, they are able to sleep up here. So that is it for this Outback, you guys. If you have any questions or concerns, please let us know, and we are happy to help.